Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Elle if you're new here and if you're not, thanks so much for coming back and hanging out with me today. So today I'm doing a massive, as always, Bath and Body Works haul because I wait too long in between them and I'm like, oh, I'm gonna do one for every little special event sale they have and then I don't. So this is going to be from their 50% off fall sale and then they have the holiday bags out now and all the holiday candles and holiday scents and it's basically Christmas and has been since like the very beginning of November, probably even end of October. So I have lots of holiday candles from the new collection that I'm bugging out about to share with you guys. Oh, I love the holiday scents that they come out with because there's just so many different kinds of bakery scents and they have like a whole bakery like baked goods, sweets collection out that I'm going crazy for. So um, yeah, if you haven't been to Bath and Body Works in a while, this is what is there. This is what I picked up. Definitely so many good options. I feel like there's way more options this time of year than other times of year, especially a lot of people are like only, are fall and winter only candle burners and stuff like that. So yeah, lots of stuff. Got some body care, home fragrance, lots of candles. This is what's new. So excited. I'm really gonna try to put this video up today because I'm so tired of filming these videos <laughs> when I get back and then I never put them up in time. So then the same stuff is never in the store. Uh, life has just been crazy lately, crazy. So bear with me while I learn how to juggle things and haven't had as much time to make videos lately as I would like, not even a fraction of the amount of time I would like. So we're working on it, but here we are today. So excited, I keep holding this up. So let me just show you, they have this new candle collection. This one's Mary Cookie where they look like sweaters and a lot of them are really bakery scents. They have the cute snowflake lids and I want nearly everyone in this collection, which is rare. The notes are fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, and rich vanilla. I think I'm gonna need a second one of these. Kind of reminds me of like holiday treats or holiday cookies, whatever the Christmas cookie one at Sonoma is right now. And I have a haul of their candles as well coming. I think this will go first because it's new, it's happening. We love the Bath and Body Works. We love the new stuff. So I'm gonna share it with you. I burned it once or twice and it's actually really, it's pretty strong. Uh, these kind of scents usually aren't from Bath and Body Works like vanilla bean, total dud. So delicious, sweet, delicious cookie. If you love those kind of vanilla scents, you need this. This has the same lid, but it doesn't have the sweater wrap around, so it's kind of the same collection. This one, I've been trying to buy the candles that they were kind of uh, lower in stock on. Like they have peppermint marshmallow back. There's so many different collections that came out at once. And that sold out last year. You cannot get your hands on it, I feel like for the past two years and I wanted it. And now this year, every store I go to has like uh, so many in stock. So it wasn't one of the first ones I picked up. I'm trying to wait for candle day, but they also had these new ones come out and then there was a $12.95 sale. So, I did get a few. Anyways, orange chocolate truffle, super cute label. Love the cursive, and I don't, I'm, I don't like orange at all, but I really like this. The notes are orange zest, sea salt, and rich dark chocolate. And this is like a candy, like orange chocolates. I just don't know which one, but I actually really, really like it, which surprises me a lot. And this one did not have many in a lot of the stores I went to. So we got her. Action. It's gonna be so cute together. Oh my gosh. Next is gooey marshmallow, which sounds delectable if you're like me and you love those kind of scents. The wicks on this particular one weren't great on a lot of candles. I feel like I had to look at a lot. They're a little smaller than the others, which makes me nervous. And it's a little light. Can't really smell it. A whole lot in the jar. Seems like there are some caramel notes. The notes are torched marshmallows, brown sugar, and caramel drizzle. So super excited. I don't know if they've had this before. Someone let me know. I feel like they must have had a rendition of it, but I hope it's strong because it sounds delicious. I don't know how I'm going to pick which one of these to burn tonight, but I had to haul them first so I wasn't carrying around flames. Forgot I picked this up. This is another one of the new collections, kind of like a New York City, someone said theme. The sparkles are really pretty. Got Arctic Berry with this lid. Um, I was surprised I like this one. I do love a berry scent. It does have a strictly Christmassy vibe to it. It says made with balsam and orange essential oils with notes of frozen red berries and musk. So yeah, I really hate balsam. So that's what gives it the winter vibe. But I like it in this, so we'll try, we'll try it. The wicks are nice and chubby. I'm seeing everyone bug out about this one online. Look how beautiful this candle holder is. I should put it in my little makeshift background of some of my candle stands. I never have a background. And then I saw a cute one the other day. But look how, this looks even prettier under the lights. Oh my gosh. Everyone's bugging out about this on Instagram. Um, I feel like this is kind of the more, I don't know. They're all a little different. There's like one that leans really peach, one that leans really lavender. This one's kind of rainbow. These are $16.50 and I had some sort of coupon. 
Um, so I got it on sale. Normally, like that one, I got 75% off. This one, which was incredible. If you watched my, I think my like best SAS deals ever, like my very last video, if I do end up putting this up tonight. So yeah, then you saw, oh shoot, this one has a chip. Why me? You know, it was probably me who did it, to be honest. Crap. But yeah, I feel like these are gonna sell like hotcakes because the day they came out, people on Instagram were going nuts. By the way, if you're not following me there, I do have a Bath and Body Works and Candle and Wax dedicated Instagram account at Way Wicked Wax where I let you know things I'm buying when I go shopping, new stuff, sales, when I have new videos up related to those topics. So definitely go follow me there, check it on out. We have so much fun. And then this one's on my stand. I think I bought three of these at this point. My baby is back. I'm loving this geometric pattern, but pistachio ice cream, oh my god. This came out around Mother's Day in gorgeous floral packaging, and I've been avoiding burning the last half of it because I didn't know if it would come back, and it's so delicious. It's nice and strong in this rendition. It's beautiful. I brought this, I just brought in a candle exchange one day. I brought back frosted cranberry because it made me gag. Never burned it, but just, ugh, I can't do cranberry. I thought I liked it, but I don't. The notes are roasted pistachio, almond extract, and vanilla extract. But yeah, I, I did on I went in to do an exchange randomly. It didn't even know new candles were out. That store had put them out early. Um, and so I lost my mind and they had this one. So like it was so worth saving that candle as an exchange and bringing it in for this because they weren't on sale yet. So good, I've been burning this. I think I have two other ones. I absolutely love this one. Very almondy, delicious. Oh my god, I'm so happy they brought this back so happy one of my all-time favorites we're gonna bounce around because this is a collective haul of quite a few trips i know i have more candles somewhere but i'm gonna do what's in front of me first got a bunch of the new pocket bags that came out i got i think some of these are gifts because winter is not really my jam and then sparkling mint blossom i don't i think i have that in a soap that i haven't used yet so those are gonna be for other people but those are just some of the new ones that are out got a merry cookie because i love it they have this in a hand cream too which is odd for them to do for a candle scent, but I always love those vanilla sort of scents. And then, la 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 la, latte, gingerbread latte. That one's delicious, I love it. Lots of gourmand in the um, pocket bags as well. And then hot cocoa and cream. I think I've bought at least two or three at this point. Love it, cannot wait for that body care to come out. They've been teasing it on Instagram. Look how delectable these look love these so i need even more backups of both of those this one's in my car it's so good i love it it's so hot cocoa and cream it's so good this was from the fall 50 percent off sale it's all gone now they're saving it for semi-annual sale but just before that picked up a mini bright autumn bloom spray this ended up being like 225 plus whatever coupon i had because they're normally 450 and this is my favorite spray ever and i'm kicking myself because it came back and i didn't stock up as much as I probably should have. So I got a mini. Oh, these were from another sale date. I'm including in here. These were from the 495 single wick candle day. So they had these decorative ones. So I got a hot cocoa and cream and they're so cute. Look at these. Decadent milk chocolate, fresh steamed milk and mini marshmallows. These are absolutely perfect for gifts. I thought I would go crazy around these, but I didn't. So good job, Elle. Got a French baguette. I think I bought two of these. I bought another one. Um, it was, again, when those candles were out early, so they're supposed to be two for 16 for the single wick, but they weren't ringing up yet, so I ended up paying like way too much for them. I need to go back and get a price adjustment, but this is one of the new scents I came out with. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I hope this comes out in a three wick. This is pretty different for them. I don't know if they've ever done a bread scent, but almost every other candle company does. Kringle has a really good one, and I always love them. So the notes are warm baked bread, toasted crust, and fresh sea salt with essential oils. Totally just smells like bread. Love it. Got another one, these decorative single wicks, spiced apple toddy. So cute. I love this. I love the designs on these. They're really pushing them. Then the notes are cinnamon, clove, and apple brandy. Not really. Oh, it's, I mean, it's good. I never had spiced apple toddy, but I think that's gonna be a gift. These are half off, so they ended up being 175. Got two of the car refills of vanilla bean. This is what's in my car right now, and I love it, and I didn't know they were getting rid of it, so I bought two more. The one in there is kind of dead, and my car is starting to smell weird, so 
That came just in time. These are more half off fall items. I love the Bonfire Bash scent and I was waiting for it to go to semi-annual sale, but it was selling out. So I got it at the half off. It's kind of like a beach night sort of thing, but a little smokier, like if beach nights and Marshmallow Fireside had a baby kind of, but warmer. I don't know, it's really good. Um, a little too praline on the marshmallow for me, but we'll see. The notes are toasted marshmallows, crackling campfires, and cozy flannels. So I got the 24 hour moisture ultra shea body cream. And I had a my 25% off print coupon that I combined. So it's originally $13.50 and it went to $506. And then I got this spray as well, which is normally $14.50 and went to $544. So I got the fine fragrance mist. Yes, so excited. I was holding off on those, but. I don't think they were gonna go to semi. Got another gingerbread latte pocket back, a toasted s'mores. I think I actually have two of these. Got one the other day, and it's very marshmallow fireside-y. It's like very smoky and praline-y, so it's pretty strong. Wasn't crazy about it the other day, surprisingly. And then a vanilla chai. I'm still dying to get that candle, but I love the winter time when this comes out in soaps and everything. So super excited for that. I love chai. This was half off. I got a toasted s'mores wallflower refill. I feel like I already have one of these, but I don't know. The notes are dark chocolate, fluffy marshmallow, and graham cracker. So we'll give that one a shot. I think I had one of those, again, a print coupon. I was using them all up where you could get like for $6, the basic wallflower plug and a refill. So I, this is my second one of those and I've been redeeming them like as kind of gifts or maybe backup, I don't know. But it makes this plug 184 and the refill 266. So I just got the gray ones. That's all they had. And I got a hot cocoa and cream refill. First of, I think, many because again, obsessed with this. And then it's our milk chocolate, steamed milk, and nutmeg. Oh my God, guys, I don't know if I've told you about these, but I'm absolutely obsessed with their moisture lip crayons. And they've been on sale for $6, originally $8.50, and they went all 50% off. They I don't know why they're getting rid of them because I love them. Maybe because these are spring colors. Please come back with more winter colors. I wear one of them almost every day. Um, so they ended up being $3.18 each. I love them so much. I need to do a video on these even though they're going away. So I got one in every color. So Lily is the lightest nude one. Got lilac, which isn't a lilac color, but it's like kind of a magenta. Got tulip, which is a bright coral. And then iris, which is kind of like a burgundy dark red and then there's more in another bag that I will find. Another one is Poppy which is like a dark pure red. I got all of them guys. Some more pocket bags. Merry Berry Kiss. Again love a good berry scent and the packaging is so cute. I, I've said it before and I'll say it again. I love the packaging this time of year because they put extra effort into it and it's always so cute I feel like. Snow Kissed Citrus I got because it kind of reminded me of what was it? Ocean Citrus from the summer that I fell in love with at the semi-annual sale as it was going away. So it's pretty much the same. And then Pink Rose. And when they're clear like this, I'm always afraid they're just going to smell like pure alcohol like the one I got for Halloween did. But I don't know. Roses might be nice. This was half off with all the Halloween stuff. Got the Vampire Blood foaming mousse hand sanitizer and these are normally $5.50 so it was two dollars and six cents I love these foamy ones I feel like they're gonna last a lot longer but they're kind of overpriced that was a good deal a lot of the candles were half off got another hot cocoa and cream so I've been ripping through it you know the notes <laughs> we've been over them and then this was the time I got those candles but these are like the two new sets that came out in how cute are they together so I have two of the french baguette and then pink petal tea cake oh my god the three wick came out for candle day last year. Everyone lost their minds because they wanted it to come back for the longest time. It's so strong, so I'm hoping a single wick will be less strong. The notes are pink rose petals, pound cake, and vanilla glaze. It's honestly like an unearthly experience. It's so good. I'm hopping around all over the place. These were from a various $2.95 wallflower day. I didn't use a coupon on top of it, so there must not have been one that you could use. But I got one linen and lavender. I already have a bunch of this because I love it. It's super strong. Um, you hear about this in my Bath and Body Works empties or candle empties whenever I get around to filming that, which I also do. So make sure you're subscribed, join our Glam Bam fam, turn on notifications so you don't miss it. Lots of Bath and Body Works home fragrance candle videos here. Uh, the notes on this are crisp linen, lavender, sea salt, and burst of fresh air. Love it. Even though I hate linen scents, but I love that one stronger than lavender vanilla got two pumpkin donut shop because look at that label i ordered some of that candle online and i love it so gourmand and yummy i don't think i ever 
hauled it, but I'm obsessed. So I got two. The notes are Sweet Bakery Air, Fluffy Cake Donut, and Pumpkin Spice. Can it get any better? There's so many good wallflower scents out right now. I need to find another place to put them so I can plug in more at a time. Got two of the Frozen Lake ones in my bathroom right now because I love it. These are like so many of my favorites. The notes are Juniper Berry, Eucalyptus, and Lavender, which is super weird because I hate two out of three of those things, but together somehow I like them. So another sweater collection candle is Toffee Brittle. Love this one. Oh, so good. Maple cream, brown butter, and coconut sugar. Coconut? It's just so delectable. You do kind of get a little coconutty. It's so it's so good. It's It smells like a Samoa. The Girl Scout cookie Samoa. That's what it is. And I love those too. I was debating over this one forever. I'm so excited this kind of scent came back. Peppermint brownie. I saw it teased on Instagram, but here it is. So cute with the little trees. And this reminds me so much of Mint Mocha Bark, which was one of my first ever Bath & Body Works candles, and I loved it. If you watch my older videos, you know I'd rave about it. The notes are Crushed Candy Canes, Rich Mocha, and Whipped Cream. So many different peppermint scents, and I'm not huge on peppermint, but I keep buying it. But this one I really like. It's just so, it's so good. I was always in the mood for it. Probably burning in the background of a lot of my older videos circa like 2014. And did you think we were done? No, not even close. Okay, so more fall half off stuff. These were normally $14.50. I was so excited when they came out, but I waited for a sale. They went half off and I had 20% off, so they went to $5.80. These are the little bath cubes, the warm vanilla sugar. I don't think they're gonna make it to semi either, but I was so excited. There's 16 in here, mini bath fizzies. And I love that because their bath bombs are so big and so expensive. So this seems more cost effective. So I've been, I have my eye on these forever. I should have picked up another one. So excited. Along the same lines, I picked up a half off bath bomb. Price still wasn't great. They're normally $7.95, got it for $3.18. Almond vanilla chai, extra foaming bath fizzy. They have the cute little leaf imprint. So I've been dying to get these. They're so cute. This cellophane collection is so gorgeous. I got black tie, which I love. I fell in love with last year, but I've never had it in a full size and they're just holographic and gorgeous. Love that packaging. The notes are aromatic sage, dark tonka bean, and rich sandalwood. And I feel like this could please anyone. Very unisex, musky, kind of like mahogany teakwood, but a little different and not as Abercrombie. Got gingerbread and caramel. Oh, so delectable and yummy. And again, a gorgeous geometric packaging. The notes are gooey caramel, warm vanilla cream, and gingerbread spices. So good. Wicks super long. Look healthy. <laughs> And I got another blueberry maple pancakes. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. It means so much. I hope you enjoyed seeing my haul and seeing what deals and stuff is new at Bath & Body Works. Give this video a thumbs up so I know you liked it. Let me know down below what you've been loving, especially in the new candles. Would love to talk to you guys. I always reply. Remember to find me on Way Wicked Wax on Instagram or LOL86. My beauty and personal account, all my social media links are down below. Subscribe, turn on notifications, join our Glam Bam fam, and I will see you guys in my next video. Three, two, one, bam!